Hello, I am Sally Glenn of Saved by Grace Ministries. Thank you for joining me today. My message this time is how to get your full reward. I'm going to the book of 2 John. This is a short book, but it's full of good information, especially when it comes to receiving a full reward. <laughs> this is something that I sure want to do, and I'm quite sure that you do too. So then, I'm going to the book of 2 John, and I have three short points which are essential. Verse 5. Now, I want to urgently remind you, dear friends, of the old rule that God gave us right from the beginning, that Christians should love one another. Now, that should sound familiar. As Jesus said, Thou shalt love the Lord thy God with all thy heart, soul, mind, and strength. And also, there is the golden rule that says, Do unto others as you would have them to do unto you. So, first point then is love one another. Now for the second point, let's go to verse 7. Watch out for false teachers. There are many of them who don't believe that Jesus Christ came to earth as a human being with a body like ours. And such people are against the truth and against Christ. Beware of being like them and losing the prize <gasps> that you and I have been working so hard to get. So, watch out then for false teachers. Then, in verse uh, 8 and 9, we see our third point. See to it that you win your full reward from the Lord. For if you wander beyond the teaching of Christ, you will leave God behind. While, if you are loyal to Christ's teachings, you will have God too. Then you will have both the Father and the Son. So, see to it that you win your full reward from the Lord. And this is how you do it. Verse 9 again. Do not wander beyond the teaching of Christ, which uh, would mean leaving God behind. While being loyal to His teachings, you will have God too. You'll have both the Father and the Son. This is indeed how you get your full reward. Again, love one another, watch out for false teachers, and beware of false teachings. Let's pray. Father God, thank you for sending Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, for coming and taking on my sin, for dying in my place. I look to you, Lord, as having done that personally for me. Lord, I ask your help in doing these things that I might receive my full reward. It is in your name I pray. Amen. Please share and like us on Facebook and subscribe to my YouTube channel.